It's very good to see you. And congratulations on your, your 50th. Uh, th that's more times wow. than anyone has ever been on the right. show. Well, to be, to be fair to me, the first 43 times were like year one. Uh -huh. And it'd be 5.30, and I'd be at home, and I'd get a call, and it'd be, Joey Buttafuoco has violated his parole. <laughs> we need a lead guest pronto. <laughs> and so that was the first year. 43. Yeah. It slowed down a little yeah, after But that. you haven't slowed down at all. You no. still, still have the towel, which is good. You know, we were going to get you yes. a new towel to celebrate your 50th appearance on the show, and then we forgot about it. <laughs> <laughs> We will get you a new towel. <laughs> and Continue. A month. Yes. And a month. No, let's. We'll make up after the yes. show. By the way, I you've done one show. I've been on that show. Explain right. the concept of this show because it's one of the strangest ideas for a show ever. I think. Thank you. Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> uh, I build stuff live. We have someone in. Uh, Adam Sandler's coming in uh, tomorrow night. He's you your guest tomorrow. Last right? week. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And we take a project each week, and we build it out for an hour. And we have one hour to complete the project. So it's all done live. It's all done within the span of the show. I'm answering questions, doing the hosting stuff. The guest is building. We're trying to interview him, and it's all done live in one hour. Yeah, but I didn't know what really it was going to be. I mean, I knew the basic concept, but then I show up, and they're like, you're going to build a loft. And so we had a bunch of wood, and we had tools and screws. And the whole time Adam's talking, I'm sitting there drilling screws. Rules in, screws in, building a loft. And what happens? What becomes of the loft? Will that go in the Smithsonian? That no, no, that no, 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 no. We donate all the projects to rich people. Oh, to rich people? Yeah. <laughs> so I feel like been there, done that with the orphans. You know Poor what I mean? People get everything. <laughs> well, you know, it's funny. I was telling Jimmy when we were doing the loft, I have this theory, which is if your bed is too low to the ground, you're a loser. Uh -huh. And if it's too high off the ground, there's a sweet spot of 27.4 inches, which is, I grew up with a futon on the floor. Right. Loser. Then you get to a prison cot, and you're upstairs, right, on the, right. On the bunk bed, Three <laughs> Stooges triple style. But if your bed is just this height, like if you go to a Four Seasons or La Quinta and measure the bed, <laughs> it will be 27.4 inches, the exact height you want to be. Everyone should be striving for that. <laughs> will Adam Sandler be building a bed tomorrow? What are you going to build with him tomorrow? No, no, we save the good projects for the A-listers. I see, so okay. <laughs> no, we are doing a... <laughs> we are doing a panic room. For real? A real, yeah. So you'll seal him in a room? Well, no. I built a panic room in my house. Why? Just to panic in? Oh, really? Just... Sometimes you need a quiet place to masturbate. I mean, let's be honest. <laughs> the chances of gangbangers breaking into my house is, like, way less than 1%. But the chances that Daddy needs a little quiet time is way... It's astronomical. I'm so, definitely going to get you that towel. Yeah. yeah. So, uh... <laughs> so... <laughs> My glass is fogging up. Yeah, they are. Yeah. See, oh. the towel again. Wow, yeah. this thing is yeah, unbelievable. Yeah, that's why I got the towel, everybody. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you like that, subscribe to our YouTube channel for all the latest videos. And if you didn't, subscribe anyway. It's free. Who cares?